how are you all i hope fine yes now uh, today we are going to start with the most simple chapter of your syllabus that is analysis of financial statements yes it is very simple right but before starting this chapter i must remind you the process of accounting which you have learned in your last class that is class 11th now the process of accounting at very first started with voucher now what is voucher it is nothing but a written evidence of business transaction means whatever transactions takes place in the business each and every transaction has written evidence of it and that written evidence of transaction is known as voucher so the journey of accounting started with voucher after voucher we passed journal entries from such vouchers now what is journal entry it is nothing but recording of transactions from voucher to either in subsidiary books or in journal book right now after journal entry we moved further to ledger posting in ledger posting try to remember what we did sir in ledger posting all the transactions of similar nature were transferred to a single account like all the journal entries related to purchase were transferred to purchase account all the journal entries related to salary were transferred to salary expense account so in ledger posting we recorded transactions in different accounts on basis of their nature now after journal entry we prepared trial balance now it is important to understand here why we prepared trial balance trial balance is a statement which shows that all the steps we followed till now that is journal entry and ledger posting are mathematically correct or not so to check the mathematical accuracy we prepared the trial balance in trial balance what we did try to remember in trial balance we noted down all the names of accounts and either they have debit balance or credit balance that balances were noted down did that in trial balance now if the trial balance matched then we understand that yes sir we have prepared all the things correct so after preparing trial balance the final step of accounts comes is financial statements now what is financial statements financial statements is a summary of all the transactions which a business does in a particular year it shows profit and loss of the business and the financial position of the business what is financial position that how much resources the business have how much liabilities the business have so financial statements is nothing but a summary of business transaction to depict financial performance financial performance means whether the business has earned profit or loss and financial position of the business financial position means what are the total assets and liabilities of the business at that particular time now as we are studying company accounts so we will study financial statements of companies that what financial statements or what such things are included in financial statements so the inclusion of financial statements is given in companies act 2013 and all the it is mandatory for all the companies to follow companies act 2013 and in section 2 subsection 40 the list of this five things is given to be included in financial statements that is balance sheet statement of profit and loss cash flow statement statement of changes in equity and at last notes to accounts now from this you are aware about balance sheet statement of profit and loss and notes to accounts as we did in the last chapter and uh, sir what about cash flow statement cash flow statement we would be studying in chapter number 6 sir what about statement of changes in equity no we are not you would not be studying this particular thing in this class it is not in your syllabus right now this was our whole journey of accounting right so is the purpose of my accounting over if i ask you is the purpose of my accounting over sir is there anything more to do after preparing financial statements the answer is yes sir please explain 
what we shall do after because all the things we needed profit loss assets liabilities we get from financial statements what is required more to do after this financial statements let me explain it to you through this video now uh, these two companies both of them prepared their financial statements and i have taken some figures of these companies from their financial statements only that is figure figures of company a and figures of company b so the sales of company a is 1 lakh and the profit of company a is rupees 10000 similarly sales of company b is 5 lakh and profit of company b is rupees 40000 now if a person ask you that which company is better you can you can see the profits of both the company and if a person ask you which company is better as a layman you would suddenly answer that sir company b is better why because it is earning higher profit sir company b is earning 40000 you can see here and company a is earning only 10000 but as a commerce student you will not answer like this you will do some calculations here sir what type of calculations you will find percentage of profit to sales that is 10000 divided by 1 lakh multiplied by 100 that is 10% it means this company is earning 10% of whatever sales it makes similarly if i calculate the same thing for company b that is percentage of profit to sales that is 40000 divided by 5 lakh multiplied by 100 it is only 8% so now you can see the difference here that this company is earning only 8% of whatever sales it makes and whether where company a is making 10% profit of its sales so now you can answer that sir company a is better because it is earning profit with better efficiency than company b so what we understood here that sir the answer of this question was not possible to calculate by just figures of financial statements what i needed to do sir we need to make some calculations we need to make some calculations acha on what this calculation should be made sir this calculation should be made on the figures of financial statements now if these calculations such type of calculations are made on figures of financial statements then such calculations are known as analysis of financial statements